Brad Johnson here from Johnson.audio, and today I'm going to talk to you about pre-production. Now, I'm currently in the process of working with a songwriter and singer, Joshua Noah Snell, and we did an interview a while back, and we're doing a bit of our pre-production process right now on his songs, and I had just an acoustic and vocal performance with him, and I just got back some files from a arranger, Joseph Smith, who's helping me do some pre-production planning. And I just kind of want to show you um, just what it looks like to have a pre-production demo for your production as a blueprint to then take forward to show the other musicians. It's really just about vibe. It's about getting some ideas out there. It's not about writing the perfect parts. And so I just kind of want to show you what we're using right now for Joshua's project and what it's going to look like moving forward. So I'm going to jump into my DAW session and kind of show you both files. So here we go. All right, here in my Pro Tools session, I just threw in a bounce of my acoustic and vocal performance only and then the pre-production idea that we have. And I'm just going to flip back and forth between the two and you're going to be able to hear kind of that vibe that we're going for. I apologize for being in mono and not in stereo for some reason uh, with QuickTime and the way that I record these videos, it does that. And if anybody out there watching this can help me figure that out, I'd be very appreciative because it's been kind of a frustrating challenge for me, but whatever, I digress. So let's uh, just go ahead and we're gonna listen to the acoustic version. Here we go. Give me a light, light. Super cool, and now we're gonna listen to the pre-production um, arrangement over it. Give me a light, light. Please light my flame. Hope again. Stars in my eye. Oh man, I love it. It just adds so much more to it, and you can get, you just get the vibe. Like the drum part isn't perfect, the keys and all that stuff's not perfect, but it just you give that to a musician, and they'll know what to do with it. And that is the reason why you do pre-production. That is the purpose of it. It's the blueprint. And I just think right there, that's a really good example of just taking what you kind of feel within the acoustic version and blowing it out and giving somebody a roadmap to where you will succeed every single time. And that is pre-production. Thank you so much for watching that. I hope it inspires you to start doing more pre-production for your songs and just create that blueprint and just get the vibe going for the song so that way you can take that and give it to your musicians so they have something to work off of. Please give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button to all my other subscribers. I appreciate your continued support. Leave me a comment below and reach out and say hello. I'd love to hear from you. I am Brad Johnson at Johnson.audio where I help you sing your story, mix your mission, and master your message. I will see you on the next video. Bye.